Hello everyone and thank you so much for clicking on this video. We are going to make a super cute um, St. Patrick's Day type of a craft. Um, I wanted a cute garland to go over my door and so um, right now I'm just painting with my little girls these uh, four or yeah four three leaf clover <laughs> three leaf clover um wooden hanger things that I got from the Dollar Tree um the paint is just from all over I'll leave the names of the colors that I used in the description but um I used a pink a purple a blue and a green and we're just painting all of these clovers here So once all of the clovers are painted and completely dry, then um, this is a different day where <laughs> Neelix stayed home from school because she wasn't feeling well. But I was trying to think of how can I make these glittery and the easiest way possible. And so I'm testing out this spray adhesive and sprinkling on some glitter onto a little piece of this clover just to see how well um, it sticks and stays because <laughs> I don't want glitter everywhere um, after I apply it. So I'm just testing it all out and I have my little helper with me. I'm just using this Mod Podge gloss spray um, and then the layer doesn't glitter. Um, I'm just testing it out to see if it'll be like a good adhesive and then I sprayed a coat over this so it's still, shoot, <laughs> it's still tacky. I'll just wait for it to dry but it looks good so hopefully it dries nicely and then So while I'm waiting for those to dry, I also got these um, metal and wood clovers and I didn't want the metal part so I'm just unscrewing the three little screws on the back and then just peeling it off of that um, metal backing and then I am taking the same light green color that I used for the big clovers and I am giving these a uh, couple coats of paint using my heat gun in between coats um, to make the drying time faster. So now that everything is dry, um, I have this um, burlap and polka dot wire ribbon. It's a nine foot piece that I found in my craft stash. And I am just, um, I laid out how I want all of these clovers in the order and everything and the spacing. And so I am just hot gluing them all on this ribbon, trying to make it as even as possible. Um, but yeah. 